Hey everyone, this is Larry with Today I Feel Like. Today we're going to take a look at the Hohem iSteady M6 Smartphone Gimbal Kit. Now, smartphone gimbals have been around for a while. Some people think they're not really relevant anymore, but I'm going to show you why I like to use smartphone gimbals and we're going to unbox this and test it out. So let's jump in and here we go. Okay, before we get this out of the box, let me tell you two of the main reasons why I want to use this gimbal. One is I like shooting motion time lapses. That allows me to have my smartphone camera travel across the scene so that I can actually shoot a time lapse and have it move. The other thing is this gimbal has AI tracking. So if I'm out and about shooting somewhere, I can set this up and I can move freely throughout the scene and the gimbal is going to track me. That's something I was only able to do if I had someone filming me or if I was shooting with say a 360 camera and reframed it. But now I'll be able to do that with just my smartphone. So yeah, let's go ahead now and get this out of the box and take a look at everything that comes in the kit. Okay, so here's everything that comes with it. We are going to get a case here, which we were able to see, which is very nice. So you can carry everything with you in one nice package. You don't have to worry about losing anything. You know where you can put everything back once you're finished and you know where it'll be the next time you get ready to use it. So we also have our manual here. This is going to uh, give us all of our uh, all of our information that we need to be able to use the gimbal. We're going to have a, a little mini tripod that we can use if we want to set the gimbal down somewhere and uh, and not actually handhold it. So there's that. Um, we have the gimbal itself, so we'll get this all set up and charged up and working shortly. We have a couple of cables. We have a uh, it looks like a USB-C to USB-C cable so that you can charge this thing up or you can actually charge up your smartphone because you can charge your smartphone from the actual gimbal itself. Uh, we also have a USB-A to USB-C, which I believe is, uh, this one I believe is going to be for the charging of the gimbal. So, and then we cannot forget we have our silica gel because, well, we always have to have our silica gel. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and uh, let's get this thing powered up and test it out and see how it actually performs. Okay, so I'm uh, recording now. I'm using the gimbal and I have it set with the AI tracking on and it's very easy to know when the AI uh, tracking device is uh, working because there's a green light when it's on and there's a red light when it's off. And it's very easy to turn on and off there's a switch on the side that allows you to actually power it on and then to start the AI tracking you just give it the OK sign and when you want to stop it you just give it the palm and there you go it turns off and you have a red symbol on there now little red light to turn it back on give it the OK sign turns right back on and you can start rolling so all right but let's see how this thing really works well when it follows me around so let's go and put this uh, let's go ahead and put this gimbal down and show you how it looks when it really, really uh, just shines as it follows me through a scene. Okay, so I have my gimbal setting down here and it's just uh, standing up with a little mini tripod and I have the AI tracking activated. So now, if I wanna move, I can move wherever I want throughout this scene here and the gimbal is gonna move along with me. And the great thing about this is that because this little AI tracking device is separate from the gimbal itself, you can actually use this AI tracking with any app. So if you're someone who likes to film with a particular app, maybe you like Filmic Pro, maybe you like the native camera app of your smartphone, you could do that. It's very, very easy to just use it in general. So some of these gimbals that use AI tracking require that you actually use their app. Hohim allows you to use your app, their app if you want to, but you can also choose to use any app that you want to use so that you have complete control. Now, another thing that I really like about the Hohim iSteady M6 is that it's really great for vlogging. Now, with other gimbals, if you turn your phone around so that you use the good cameras to vlog with, what happens is, is that you end up seeing the gimbal in your shot. Well, the Hohem iSteady M6 has solved the problem, whereas it sort of flips around in a weird way, but it does it in such a way that you don't see the gimbal head in your shot. So 
Other gimbals, sometimes I see the, the, the gimbal with the 1X lens, sometimes I only see it with the uh, ultra wide angle, but I can actually vlog with the 1X or the ultra wide and I don't see it in my shot at all. In fact, right now, I actually have the ultra wide angle uh, lens on and you don't see it. Now, I can move it in such a way that you see it, but there's really no need for that. And with the uh, AI tracking on here, it just makes it very easy to make sure you stay in frame and everything looks great. Now there is also a light on the AI tracker so that you can light up your subject if it's getting dark. So it is getting dark out here. It's not really super dark. So you may not be able to see it all that well because it is a small light. It's not the brightest light, but if you are in pitch black or a very dark situation, something is better than nothing. And this could really come in handy. So again, it's not the brightest light, but any light will do in a pinch. Well, unfortunately, there is not a single cloud in the sky today to get a cool time lapse. So I think what we're going to do is go out into the night and see if we can get a cool night lapse, motion night lapse, and see how that looks. So let's head out, try it out, and see how it looks. All right, so I'm outside here and I have the gimbal set up. I'm using my Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. Let's take a look at a time lapse using the Hohim Joy app. And then let's take a look at a time lapse using a third party app like ProCam. everyone well there you go that is a look at the Hohim iSteady M6 smartphone gimbal kit and you're gonna get the mini tripod the gimbal and a fill light that has an AI vision sensor in there so that you can track yourself as a subject or someone else as a subject it really is fantastic I also love that this thing has a payload of 400 grams so you don't have to worry about weighing down the motors if you have a large phone something like an iPhone 14 Pro Max or a Galaxy S23 Ultra or some of the other flagship phones that are a little bit larger and heavier you're going to be able to uh, use that use those phones with this gimbal no problem in fact you can even use extra accessories like an anamorphic lens or filters or whatever you want without having to worry about weighing down the motors because you're really going to have enough of a payload with those 400 grams so yeah anyways i'm going to leave links to it down below in the video description so that you can check it out and pick one up if you're interested i'm also going to leave links to my amazon page and my social media contacts so you can reach me elsewhere and i hope you enjoyed seeing this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel and follow me on instagram and I am Larry with Today I Feel Like. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and air grease. Peace.